Would you mm-hmm. say the culture in Community Empire is is different from like a quote unquote like Facebook group? Absolutely, yeah. So, like I said, I meet everyone who comes in. So, which is why I'm on video all day. Um, oh and I'll do an introduction for you into the community. Um, I'll let you know who's a resource for you. Um, we have um, two things you can do. One is our directory, which is like I said, that mini LinkedIn. So you can you know give a little bit more of a robust profile. Um, and then we also have like a meet and greet. Um, component, which is you can do it one-on-one via email. You just sort of opt in and you get an email a week that says, hey, you're into this industry, you're into this topic, you should meet Jane or you should meet Joe. If you want to meet them, click here, set up a meeting. So you just get connected right away. And we also do new member meetings every week. Um, And so it's really um, that human connection that makes the difference. So all I'm trying to do inside Community Empire is to get people comfortable enough to share their work. We need you to build in public, we need you to ask the questions. Like we were just talking about how you, there's no bad questions for GPT. Yeah. Same thing inside Empire. You know, someone had to build a funnel in two days for their business because it was a tutoring business and the testing date was in like 10 days. He's like, oh I got to get this thing going. I've got to, I just landed a partnership with a guy who's an incredible tutor. We're going to put this program together, but I have to do it like now. Like, what do I do now? You know, and he's been, he's just basically going to a Google search box. So he comes to Empire post the challenge and then people just sort of jump in and be like, well, if I was doing it, I would use this or someone gave him a template for a funnel. Another person was an expert on now kit, convert kit and helped them out with that. And like collectively, when he woke up the next morning, he, cause he's in Europe, he was like, oh my God, there's all this resources and information right here. I can, you know, take this, tweak it and put it to work right away. Um, as opposed to just DIYing it out of the box. So mm. that's the real value to me in empire is being able to say what you're doing so people understand you because if you start talking about some of this stuff to your friends or to your spouse or your significant other they're like i'm i don't want to hear about robots anymore i don't want to hear about the future right such a we are the people who love the robots yeah yeah, all of the robots bring them right right okay so then would you say that this group sort of attracts like a specific type of person that's a great question yes these are people who are inspired not just people who are our reply guys back to Greg's messages. These are people who are inspired to actually do something. Right. Either they want to change what they're doing or they actually want to start something. And so that's why we give them that sort of initial 30 day challenge. They can meet that challenge and sort of show like, Hey, I'm willing to do the work. They can kind of move on into the ecosystem. Um, but yeah, these are people who are, who are actively building the more, the more active you are for me. The reason why I keep saying active is the action actually shows you the way. So you can strive, we could sit here and come up with like 97 million strategies on how to, you know, uh, launch, say an agency that does automations. We could have a bunch of different versions, but like step one is we need to get someone. How do we get someone? We got to post something. We got to find someone. We got to call someone. We got to do something. Getting people to start moving along all of a sudden shows them the opportunities that are best. So that's our focus here inside of um, 